The last time Wisconsin fa faced LSU, the scene was Lambeau Field. This time around, it was in a different NFL stadium, and there was a lot on the line. Their eighth win of the season, a ReliQuest Bowl trophy, and sending out the seniors on a high note. You want to talk about starting fast? Well, Wisconsin's first drive ended in points. Tanner Mordecai lofts one up to Bryson Green, and he mosses a dude to put the Badgers up 7-0. It's tied at 14 just before the half. Badgers on the move again, and Mordecai Mordecai finds a wide open Will Pauling in the back of the end zone for his second tutty of the game. Wisconsin led by seven at the break. Second half, more of the same, but from the ground game. Jackson Aker, the Verona legend, makes one cut and he gone. 33 yards to the house and the Badgers are in business. Unfortunately for them, the Tigers always had an answer. Fourth quarter, UW up three, and Garrett Nesmeyer hits Brian Thompson Jr. in the end zone, and that'd be your winner. Badgers fall 35-31 to and fail to send the seniors out on a high note. Probably the way we played today. We played to the finish. Obviously, we didn't come out victorious, but um, I, I know everybody in that locker room, all those seniors gave everything they got for this program and for this team today, so uh, I'm thankful for those guys. We, we obviously underperformed, um, and which sucks because... You want to do the best you can and send your seniors out on a high note. Um, but you got to carry the tradition, and now it's time for other guys to step up. Now Luke Fickle summed up the loss, obviously. It hurts, but he also praised this group for their fight all season long and said he couldn't have been prouder of the guys in that locker room. Live on a pirate ship at Raymond James Stadium, Zach Hanley, News 3 Sports.